in this video we will find the solution of the given differential equation suppose this is equation 1 and we have y dash plus 2xy is equal to x so we can compare it with the standard linear differential equation which is y dash plus p of x times y is equal to q of x now we can compare equation 1 and equation 2 so we can see that the coefficient of y is 2x in the given differential equation and in the standard linear differential equation the coefficient of y is p of x so p of x is equal to 2x and on this side of equation we have q of x and in the given equation we have x so q of x is equal to x now we will find the integrating factor which is the function of x say i of x is equal to e to the power integral of p of x dx now we can put the function p of x over here so we have e to the power integral of 2x now the integral of 2x is x square upon 2 so we have e to the power x square so the integrating factor is e to the power x square now we multiply both sides of equation 1 by e to the power x square so we have e to the power x square multiply by y dash plus 2xy is equal to x times e to the power x square now this can be written as e to the power x square multiply by y dash which is the first derivative of y or dy by dx plus 2x e to the power x square y is equal to x times e to the power x square now we have e to the power x square dy by dx plus y times derivative of e to the power x square because the derivative of e to the power x square is e to the power x square multiply by the derivative of the power and the power is x square so the derivative of x square is 2x so 2x e to the power x square can be written as d by dx of e to the power x square is equal to x times e to the power x square now we have we can see that we can apply the product rule of differentiation which is u times derivative of v plus v times derivative of u is equal to the derivative of uv so we have e to the power x square multiply by derivative of y plus y times derivative of e to the power x square so we can write d by dx of e to the power x square multiply by y is equal to x times e to the power x square now we integrate both sides with respect to x so we have e to the power x square y is equal to integral of x times e to the power x square dx and then we have e to the power x square y is equal to integral of e to the power x square and we must have the differential of the power x square which is 2x dx but we can see that we don't have 2 in the given integral so we will divide it multiply the whole integral by 1 upon 2 so that again we have x 1 upon 2 multiplied by 2x is 2x now we have e to the power x square y is equal to half integral of e to the power x square 2x dx is equal to e to the power x square plus c so we will do some more simplification e to the power x square y is equal to half e to the power x square plus c now 
we can divide both sides by e to the power x square so we have 1 upon e to the power x square multiply by half e to the power x square plus c so 1 upon e to the power x square multiply by half e to the power x square will be half plus 1 upon e to the power x square multiply by c is c upon e to the power x square and the final solution is y is equal to half plus c times e to the power minus x square and this is the required solution of the given differential equation.